Northern Ireland is being inundated with applications for factory pig farms, not for the benefit of local people, but for banks, venture capitalists, and agribusiness companies such as meat processing and farm animal feed companies. The planning application for a giant pig factory near Belfast and accompanying anaerobic digester was swept through despite huge local opposition founded on medical advice that people's health would be affected and reports that local wildlife habitats would be poisoned with excess animal waste. When it came to the planning application for the factory farm, there were 250,000 people online who said no, they didn't want it. And there were over a thousand letters written by local residents who said, which is higher than any objections to anything else in the Newton Abbey area, said we absolutely don't want it. And one person said, oh yeah, this is a great idea. And we were utterly shocked that that level of numbers wasn't considered. The elected representatives there don't have an appreciation of the environment. They still think it's something to exploit and to make money from. Uh, jobs comes before the long-term health of the people. I sat on the, the planning committee until I learnt of this size and scale of a factory and I removed myself as soon as possible from the decision-making process so I could work with those who object. I can hold my head high and say I fought against this. There's individuals there who should hold their head in shame. Planning seems to be a war of attrition. It seems to be very adversarial. It seems to be based on the person with the most power wins. It seems to be undemocratic. And there's almost a culture within the planning system now that it has to give 100% approval to these developments. But that's where they're wrong. You know, the planning system is about mediating interests for the common good. The planning system is about balance. It's about sustainable development. It's about protecting rural communities and the environment. And it's as if the people responsible for the planning system now have lost their soul. I do not want my kids, my family, eating stuff that's pumped full of antibiotics. We have no traceability of what is in our meat that we go to a supermarket and buy. So, those who do eat meat can support family farms like these by only buying meat with a high animal welfare label. Whether it's in a restaurant or a cafe, a shop or a supermarket, look for RSPCA Assured, Outdoor Bread, Free Range or Organic. Please help close the door on any more factory farms by signing our petition. <laughs> <laughs>